We had some drama in LA, the Bucks versus the Lakers. When you're having a losing season, I guess you gotta get into a fight. You gotta complain, you gotta, you gotta do something because you can't take the L's. We'll get to that fight later. The Bucks putting in work, going up big, adding to the frustration. What a move from the Greek freak. And here is the drama. Swaggy P gets rejected and then throws a push and then Greg Monroe and then they're ready to go. Oh, oh. And somehow D'Angelo Russell gets ejected from this game. He gets thrown out with Nick Young and Greg Monroe. And honestly, when you see the replay, Nick Young just got blocked. Why did he shove? See, the rookie put his hands up. He's smart. He's not getting thrown out of this game. He's gonna stay in the game and he's gonna continue to get stats, continue to help his team win. I don't know what got into Nick Young. I don't know what happened there, but <laughs> this just sums up the Lakers season. Actually, the last Laker video I made when Russell let the ball go out of bounds and I said, give that guy a manual. But here comes some rage. They're gonna relieve Brandon Ingram. Driving on the Greek Freak baseline, finishing with the slam. Lakers have time to get back in this game. Clarkson making it splash. Less than five minutes to go. Under three minutes. It's the rookie. See, he's still in the game. And the Bucks win this game. DeMarcus Cousins sat out this game with a sore knee. And so far, this experiment has not really been working. But it might be a coaching issue because it doesn't look like he knows how to use these two players on the court at the same time. A lot of times I see Cousins at the top of the key, wondering why is he there? Why don't they use him more in the paint? 